With stay at home orders, shutdowns, and challenges to reopening, small businesses have struggled. But the founder of one West Michigan company, rather, one Michigan company, saw a new opportunity to help. Adam McFarlane, owner of Kalamazoo Candle Company, joining us now to talk about the new Black Label collection. Adam, what's it all about? Hey, thanks for having us. Um, so when we started this thing seven years ago, Kalamazoo Candle Company, I, I never dreamed it would be what it is today, um, you know, selling our candles in stores 30 states away from us. And uh, during uh, the COVID-19 shutdown, obviously, uh, we, we had some, from, some free time. We weren't able to do all of our normal operations um, with our store being to shut down in downtown Kalamazoo. Uh, so we took the time and really just evaluated, um, you know, things that our customers have wanted over the, over the years. And uh really stretching out and, and coming up with uh, a line of candles that uh, is a little bit more reflective of the urban and kind of industrial feel that uh, Kalamazoo is all about. Most definitely. So this Black Label collection, what kind of scents materials are being used? Sure. So all of our candles are always made with 100% soy wax uh, and none of the nasty chemicals that are in a lot of other candle lines. Um, so we picked some of our top eight fragrances for the Black Label Collection because we really wanted to put these front and center. We know that our customers love them, um, and we really wanted to highlight them even more and give them a, a, a little more of a modern feel in terms of what they uh, what they bring to their home. But even our wax, the soy that we use in our wax is farmed in the Midwest. So everything we use is made in America. It's handcrafted right in Kalamazoo here in southwest Michigan. Yeah, that's pretty special, and that's uh, kind of what makes them highly sought after as a Michigander because you're made right here. But uh, just being able to explode as a small business seven states away, it's very impressive. How has COVID-19 impacted sales for you, and then how are you overcoming that? Yeah, obviously we were our retail store in downtown Kalamazoo was shut down for a few months, but uh, 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 luckily or fortunately we had already developed an e-commerce presence. So a lot of sales moved for us online and we just kind of retooled our focus and uh, moved a lot of things online rather than in our store. But now with things being able to be back open, uh, we're, you know, we're allowing people back in our store. And uh, really, uh, a lot of stores around the country are kind of like Michigan and allowing people back into their stores. So even our wholesale customers, um, you know, West Coast, down south, are able to start shipping our candles like uh, we used to. And, and that, that does feel really nice. Um, but we're really, really happy to have people back in our store and be able to, um, you know, do our, our walk in candle making or even doing candle making out on our sidewalk on Fridays here in downtown Kalamazoo, uh, like they've, they've been letting us do. That's great, Adam. Thank you so much. Very informative. If you want to support small businesses, Kalamazoo Candle Company is the one to do so. You can find out more by heading to their website. For now, it's 853. More news after this break.